with a 10th race to start. The late double, Summer Soul romped at Colonial Downs. Hot shot Michelle, a half-sister to Jenna's Beach Boy. Confederacy, a beaten favorite, has missed a month. Over on the lead by a length and a half. Summer Soul sank on the outside. It's hot shot Michelle. Unique count over his fourth. Then a length and a half to Tiger's Woods, followed by Confederacy. After that, Lifetime Romance. Another two, it's Art with Heart. Length and a half to Beach Dwell, and two and a half, Doers and Dreamer. Off stride, Art with Heart. Quarter, 29 seconds. It's Hot Shot Michelle leading it by two. Exotic count over second, the same margin. Summer's Soul third. Two and a half to Unique count over. Then a length and a half back, Confederacy. With Tiger's Woods alongside Lifetime Romance. Another two and a half to Beached Whale and two, Doers and Dreamer. Half 57 and four. On to the far turn. Hot shot Michelle by a length and a half. Zada count over second by two. Confederacy moving steadily on the outside. Now flushes out some cover with Summer Soul fourth. Then Lifetime Romance fifth. Approach three quarters. Hot shot Michelle on the inside. On the outside, exotic count over. Three quarters and one, 27 even. They come to the top of the stretch. Yeah, and exotic count over on the outside. Tangling with hot shot Michelle. Here comes Confederacy now. Moving strongly on the outside for Pierce. It's Confederacy in front and drawing away. Exotic count over. Clings to the place spot. Beached Whale third in 155 and one. One month layoffs just don't seem to matter here tonight, Ken. Confederacy hadn't raced in 29 days, was out the whole mile from post 10, and made it look easy. So much for handicapping. And that's a double tonight for trainer Brent Pelling, the presidential ball filly owned by Tony Cherevelli of Hamilton, Ontario.